Hey guys, this is Nicholas. Today Sony gave us a glimpse of what the future of drones will look like for a price that is more than most people's monthly salary. That's right, $9,000 before tax. What's so special about this drone that Sony believed that they can demand a king's ransom for it? Here are all the details that you need to know. First of all, this is not the first time that we saw this drone. Sony unveiled their very first drone, the AirPeak S1, during the Consumer Electronics Show in January 2021. However, Sony has been super quiet on the pricing until today. In addition to the pricing, Sony also gave us the full spec of this drone to entice us to swipe our credit card. So let's go through them one by one. As a starter, Sony claims that the AirPeak system will enhance creativity for a seamless drone experience. That means the AirPeak S1 is supported by a remote controller, an app, and cloud service which work together to create a high-performance aircraft system. So it integrates piloting, camera work, flight programming, and data management to make the AirPeak system comprehensive and easy to use. Next. The AirPeak S1 is powerful, really powerful. It can achieve a maximum speed of 55.9 miles per hour or 25 meters per second. It can also achieve maximum angular velocity of 180 degrees per second, as well as altitude angle up to 55 degrees. My god, this is really not for the regular YouTubers like me. This is more geared towards the professional photographers and videographers. Next, the propulsion system. It is designed by Sony engineers to achieve maximum flight performance and energy efficiency. The brushless motor is powerful yet lightweight, which can optimize the 17-inch propellers for maximum power and minimum energy loss. Besides, the electric speed controller is carefully designed to regulate the whole system for peak efficiency. So by integrating this propulsion system to the information from the sensors, it can achieve increased stability and highly responsive flight control. The propulsion system, which consists of the propellers, the motor, and the ESC, combined with the dedicated remote controller, can achieve optimum wind resistance. Unlike many drones that can easily be blown away by strong winds, the AirPeak S1 can withstand wind speeds as high as 20 meters per second. Sony claims that it can maintain stable flight in erratic upper level winds and strong low level canyon and coastal winds. Regarding the flight time, the AirPeak S1 has a maximum flight time of 22 minutes without a payload and can still maintain flight time for up to 12 minutes when fitted with a heavy payload such as a Sony Alpha series camera. The hot swappable battery also allows for power supply exchange without powering down the aircraft for minimal downtime. Next, the AirPeak S1 is also fitted with a retractable landing gear with open and closed legs in flight, allowing the gimbal to pan without worrying about them appearing into images. The detachable propellers are lightweight, compact, and exceptionally durable, and the quick-release mechanism makes it really easy for attachment and removal. The AirPeak S1 is equipped with Sony's image sensor 5-way stereo cameras, that is, front, back, left, right, and down. The visual information captured by this camera is then fed to the high-speed vision sensing processor and proprietary algorithm. By integrating this information to the inertial measurement unit, compass, barometric pressure, and infrared range sensors, the AirPeak S1 perceives its real-time location and positioning with incredible precision, even in enclosed spaces or when out of range of global navigation satellite system to ensure a stable flight. For low-level flight, the high-precision sensors and the refined flight algorithm 
enable the AirPeak S1 to accurately determine its environment, location, and positioning and keep low-level flight shake to minimum. Sony claims that the AirPeak S1 can fly smoothly and safely through wooded and obstacle-heavy areas for steady shooting even in the most demanding close-ups. Regarding obstacle avoidance, the AirPeak S1 combines five directional stereo cameras with infrared range sensor for optimal obstacle avoidance. The automatic deceleration and braking functions allow it to intuitively respond to the environment and its situation. The obstacle brake function can be enabled in both automatic and manual modes, and there is also the option to restrict sensing to a specific direction, or disable the braking function altogether. One of the biggest selling points of this drone is that it is the smallest drone in its class for alpha mirrorless cameras. With the custom-designed powerful motor and compact frame, the AirPeak S1 is capable of carrying a camera system, including the gimbal, of up to 5.5 pounds or 2.5 kilograms. It is fully compatible with the Alpha Series full-frame mirrorless camera. The AirPeak S1 opens up the possibility for professional creators. But probably not for amateur YouTubers like me whose channel is not even monetized yet. For cameras and lenses, you have a ton of options. You can choose the powerful low-light cameras like the Alpha 7S series or FX3 to leverage high sensitivity with stability to capture vivid images even in dark conditions. You can also choose the high-resolution cameras like the Alpha 7 r series to achieve aerial imagery of outstanding quality and huge potential for commercial and industrial applications or the Alpha 9 series to capture high-quality images with ultimately low distortion, or the Alpha 1 to shoot in the air with 8K quality. The AirPeak S1 is also compatible with many E-mount prime lenses, so you can choose and pick the best models for your application. For accessories, you can get a Grimsy Gimbal T3 for AirPeak 1 that is compatible with the Alpha series cameras. Once the gimbal is connected, the quick release mechanism allows for easy attachment. And the temperature controlled IMU allows for accurate control of the gimbal in any temperature. The remote controller combines superior functionality with a comfortable design. It allows for a live view during flight and real-time control over the aircraft and gimbal. There are four customizable buttons, and the aircraft, camera, and gimbal buttons can be changed according to requirements. It is also designed to fit comfortably in the hand. The grip is shaped for secure handling, and the control stack is based on a design by the Fubata Corporation, popular with drone pilots. The holder allows for a maximum of 178.5mm, making it compatible with smartphones and tablets. It also has an HDMI port for connecting to an external screen. The AirPeak S1 comes with a mobile app called the AirPeak Flight. The app is for comprehensive monitoring and management of the aircraft, remote controller, camera, and the gimbal. From checking flight distance and battery usage to adjusting camera settings, the app is designed to optimize the flight experience. The AirPeak Flight app is fully compatible with the Alpha Full Frame mirrorless cameras, allowing for camera adjustments during flight. The app can be used in both manual mode and automatic flight mode. During the mission flight mode, the app can be used to confirm the route, execute the mission, check the status of the aircraft, and monitor the equipment. The dual operation mode allows two operators to control the aircraft and gimbal camera separately, allowing for more precise control in complex shooting. When two operators are using the remote controllers, the control stack and buttons will automatically be assigned to the pilot and camera operator accordingly. The AirPeak S1 is equipped with several different flight modes 
to make flying and creating even easier. The default velocity mode was developed in-house. This mode differs from a regular position mode by reducing the effects of wind and external influences on hovering, turning, and maneuvering, making it easier to create flight routes with more accuracy. Each flight mode allows for customization of maximum speeds, angles, acceleration rates, and other parameters. Whether it is for speed and power, or smooth and steady, pilots will be able to find a flight mode to support their optimal performance. The AirPeak S1 also comes with the standard mode, which all sensors, including obstacle detection, is turned on as default for a safe and stable flight experience. The AirPeak Base is a web app used to efficiently organize drone projects from flight planning and flight log organization to reviewing equipment status and usage. You can use the app to plan a detailed flight route, download flight log from aircraft to view data on past flights, or create a new flight plan from past flight logs. The AirPeak Base can also be used to view the equipment status and usage logs and set up error warnings and maintenance reminders to reduce the risk of unexpected problems on site. You can also set up separate accounts for managing the aircraft to ensure better security. The AirPeak S1 can automatically run a full system check before starting the motor. It will alert the pilot to any possible issues and restrict takeoff and landing if necessary. The S1 is also capable of self-check during flight and can immediately notify the pilot if there is an issue and make an emergency landing when required. Last but not least, there is a function called Return to Home. It will automatically activate if the battery is low or if the signal is lost, bringing the aircraft safely back to the home point. And if the return route has restricted airspace or obstacles, the aircraft can automatically calculate a bypass route. The return to home feature is also convenient to bring the aircraft safely back to the home point at the end of an aero imagery project. If you make it this far to the video, here is a photo of a baby panda as a reward. So there you have it. These are all the detailed information we know so far about this AirPeak S1. Do you think the AirPeak S1 justify for the $9,000 price tag? Or is there any better alternative out there? So please let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. For those who are first time here, and if you enjoy this type of videos, please consider subscribing to my channel. And if you are getting any value from this video, even just a little bit, I would greatly appreciate if you can give me a big thumbs up below. Thank you very much for watching and thank you very much for your support as always. Please stay safe and enjoy the rest of your day. I'll see you in my next video. Until then, bye for now.